Hello, hello. Today we're going to be playing a rather unorthodox playstyle, where we'll play Elden Ring PvP with only a straight sword and a shield. Now, Elden Ring has been infested with all sorts of weapon art spam and, like, spells and whatnot. It's really lost the touch that Dark Souls 3 had, so today we're going to bring it back. Now, I don't really know how good this is going to be in the Elden Ring climate, but we brought our straight sword. This is a long sword, which is very similar to the long sword in Dark Souls 3. Now, you got your R1 spam. Got the the thrusting heavy attack followed by an upward swipe. Um, brought got our parry shield. You know, it's a, it's just a small shield. It's the iron round shield. And uh, yeah, and I brought the the most Dark Souls three like armor that I could find, which is the fingerprint set, which is worn by Vike, I believe. And I brought the Urtree's Favor plus two, as usual. I brought the Green Turtle Talisman, as usual. And this time we're actually going to bring the Dagger Talisman, as we're going to be going for parries and backstabs. And uh, just see how it works out. But yeah, we're going to be bringing this. Usually I wouldn't ever bring this, but uh, since this is playing like Dark Souls 3, you might as well treat it like it. And we're also going to slap on the Crimson Amber Medallion, so maybe we could take an extra hit, maybe? I'm not really too sure what else to put here, so I was like, you know what, we could really use uh, some survivability since I'm probably going to mess up a lot. And something you may notice about this character, this is the same build, I still got the 60 Vigor 50 Arcane as last video. Um, waste not whatnot, uh, larval tools don't really grow on trees, so this will do just fine. So yeah, let's try this out in some PvP. Alright guys, I'm going to be real. I haven't done Dark Souls, 3 P uh, Dark Souls 3 PvP in like a few years. Oh, this guy's lagging. Oh, I could parry it? I didn't parry it. <laughs> oh, huge? Oh, that's good damage. Let's go. Frick, I should have brought a dagger. What was, what was I thinking? Oh! Where's my backstab? What are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh, I went off of that. This guy's super lagging, by the way. Wait, what? Gosh darn it. What the heck was that? Why is he alive? I think I just got cheated. Alrighty. Well, the events that occurred last time were quite unfortunate. Maybe uh, we won't get so unlucky. Oh shit, he has poise. What is happening? What? Oh, what is that? I want spell. Yo, poise is unfair. Unplayable. Alright, we may have to take a different approach. I may need to focus a bit more on parrying. But that might be difficult. I don't know if you can even parry jumping attacks. But I mean... Yeah. Is this guy AFK? Hello? Oh, hey. <laughs> Alright. As far as that second one didn't catch him. Ow, that hurt. The poise. I should have caught. Yeah, that would have caught if you they weren't lagging. I'm telling you. I don't know why it's so bad lately. I'm playing with people across the nation, I swear. All right, I'm really excited for this summon. This guy's name was Tarnished Pickle. Our battle will be legendary. Finally, a worthy opponent. Our battle will be legendary! Stop! Alright, Tarnished Pickle. You're the one. Why did it look like I dealt more damage than him? <laughs> I'm out of stamina, one sec. Sorry, Tartar's Pickle. Whoa, that was cool, though. 
I should use one of those sometime. How did he not parry that? That was actually totally his. That did no damage. I think parrying sucks, dude. I'm like, I don't think anything from Dark Souls 3 is any good anymore. Oh, never mind. There's a backstab. Was he hurting me with his roll? Just like a little bit? Nice catch. He didn't poise through it. We don't <laughs> neither of us having a poise to like poise. You know, if you know what I mean. No poise. This is actually pretty close. Oh Our battle was truly legendary. Tarnished pickle. See you in the next life. Well, sure was nice to go back to the old Dark Souls 3 PvP roots, but I gotta say, do not try this at home. I mean, I gotta say, it was pretty fun, like, you know, trying to, like, parry and, uh, try to get behind them and stuff. You know, just the old Dark Souls 3 stuff, you know, but, like, uh, I also didn't get too much, uh, too much webinar spam, too much, uh, dual weapons, jumping attacks, etc. You know, spells, etc. But it was fun nonetheless. But yeah, if you like this sort of content, be sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below what you think of Elden Ring PvP nowadays. Do you like it? Is it good? Is it bad? Uh, would you rather go back to like older FromSoft game PvPs? Or because I'd like to hear your take. My take is, you know, it's not great. But honestly, I didn't think Dark Souls 3 PvP was all that interesting. It did feel like a bit of a game of roll, paper, backstab, you know. A bit of a bit of a rock paper scissors type gameplay it just you know which could be fun it was just uh it just got stale after a while so i am glad to like go into a different game with, with like all sorts of unique stuff there's just, like crazy explosions going around people are spamming the hell out of rivers of blood and stuff but you know still fun but that's my take let me know yours down below but yeah if you want more elden ring from me i go live on twitch sometimes so good luck catching me and yeah that'll be it have a good one